Hi, I'm going to do a little demonstration about the auto sticks and the Dodge Charger. Uh, somebody requested I did this video, so this is for you, Art. Um, one thing to know about these auto sticks is once you put it in a the drive, these are left or rights. Some other cars do up and down instead. Um, and then the other thing to, to realize is a little different about other cars is some of them uh, will continue to shift for you even if you engage the auto stick. This one will not. As you can see in the uh, up there in the dash, you get the automatic looking thing. Um, which that indicator change, like say I'm stopped here and I want to engage manual, I can just downshift. Even though I'm in first, it's not going to do anything, but it is going to switch me over. So now on the right, you can see the little one there. It means I'm in first gear manual. And uh, to get out of manual, you have to hold this to the right, which I found out the hard way. <laughs> Took it to the dealer and I didn't know how to get it back into automatic mode. So we'll just go on a little bit here. Engage to the right to upshift. And then like I said, I'm here in third. Engage it all the way to the right and hold it. And now it selects a different gear. It's back in automatic mode. You can engage it at any time if you want to switch. Uh, like I said, you want to downshift when you're coming to a stop and you're still in automatic or you want to upshift because you're sick of it waiting to shift. Uh, I'll come up to a stop here and I'll downshift once. Okay, so I'm in automatic mode. I want to downshift. Just hit it to the left. The car's in automatic or uh, manual mode now. Overridden by me. Uh, one thing it does do is I'm going to come up to a stop in third here. You see it just switched over to one. It will downshift to one for you. Uh, but it won't upshift for you. The only other thing it does automatically that I know of is if you downshift into a gear that would normally uh, max out the RPMs, it won't do it for you or it won't downshift. So that's good, you don't have to worry about that. One thing I'm not certain of uh, is the whole multi displacement system. Uh, I'm not sure if that activates if you have automatic manual. I know it activates on automatic, but I'm not sure if it activates in uh, manual or not. Um, so I suppose if you select your own gear, it should pick up that the RPMs have been staying good for a while, but my model does not have the indicator light when the uh, MDS is on, so I'm not sure about that. You guys can figure that out for yourselves, but uh, yeah, I think that's it. Uh, thanks for watching the video, guys.